Alright guys, so today I'm going to be giving you all some more garage tips and tricks inside of Jailbreak. So let's not waste any more time and let's get into this. Now for this first trick, all you want to do is come to the interior section of the garage and just select the darkest color you have for every one of these options. For most of you guys, this will be the black color up here, but if you own Vent Black, just go ahead and use that because it's the darkest color in the game. So once you set your entire interior to the darkest color you own, now it looks like like you're kind of sitting in a void. Obviously, if you have clear windows like me, this looks a little bit weird. So now all you need to do is set your window tint to 40% and make your window color the darkest color you have as well. Now, as you guys could see, it basically looks like I'm sitting in a void. You could still see my character, but you can't really see through the other windows. So it looks pretty, pretty cool. This trick kind of makes your car windows look like a portal straight into space because when you look into it, you can't see through the other side, but you could still Still see your character. Now another trick involving voids, black holes, and death, if you come over here to the headlight color and you make it black or vanta black, you guys could see that once I turn it on, it kind of looks like the headlights were just ripped off and replaced with like a black sticker. Or if you're someone weird like me, you would probably call this a void, a black hole, or death. But either way, it is still a pretty cool trick, and obviously it does not look the best on some vehicles, but it still looks pretty good on the others. If you've ever wondered what a spoiler or rim looks like with the default color, this trick will allow you to do that. But as some of you guys may know already, some spoilers in Jailbreak have like a preset color, and most of you guys don't know how they usually look like because there isn't a default color option. But if you go over to spoiler color and you set it to white, that'll make all those spoilers with the preset colors look Look how they were meant to look like. So as you guys could see, I have the trade sale spoiler equipped right now, and this is not how it usually looks like, but if I set it to white, as you guys could see, it's colored the exact same as it's supposed to now. This also works on other spoilers as well with the preset color. As you guys could see, I have the bicycle rack spoiler set to pastel orange, and if I switch it over to white, this is how it usually looks like. This trick is probably most noticeable on the shoot spoilers because as you guys can see, I have orange equipped and it's actually orange now. And obviously, as we'd also expect, if we equip the blue shoot spoiler now, it's actually blue how it's supposed to. So yeah, that trick is mainly for people who wonder what items look like in their default color. Obviously, the trick is a little bit useless as it doesn't really do anything, but you know, it's still pretty cool looking at items how they're usually supposed to look like. Now, our final trick of the day here is also a pretty cool one. So if you go ahead and take everything off of your vehicle, all the spoilers, all the items, and then if you go ahead and set the body color to gold, there's actually something cool about it. As you guys hopefully know by now, the color chrome actually changes with the weather. It goes full black at night and it looks really shiny during the day and then it's kind of gray when it's raining, as you guys could see now. And while since the color gold also has a little bit of reflectance, the color gold also changes with the weather a little bit. As you guys could see in the rain, gold is a little bit more gray, but if I go ahead and turn the rain off, it's a little bit more colorful now. And just like chrome at night, the color of gold goes down a little bit and it's a little bit darker. So just like the previous trick, it is a little bit useless, but it's also really, really cool on some loadouts. I'm not really sure what loadout it would go good with because I'm not really that good at customizing vehicles in jailbreak, but I'm pretty sure one of you guys could find some Something that looks really really nice anyways that's pretty much it for this video make sure to give me some more garage tips and tricks down below in the comments so i can make another one of these videos in the future i don't usually ask for this but if you haven't already please subscribe it really helps the channel a lot and we're trying to get to 10,000 subscribers before june but anyways that's pretty much it for this video hopefully you've all enjoyed and i'll see you all in the next one